Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad and today we're going to show you how to transfer data from your Nintendo 3DS and pictures as well to your PC wirelessly. Now there's a couple things you'll need. Number one, you'll need a new Nintendo 3DS XL. Another thing is a desktop or laptop computer running Windows 7.1 and 7 or higher. And the last thing you'll need is Wi-Fi and they have to be running on the same network for you to transfer um, information and data wirelessly. All right, so first thing you want to do once you have all those three things is head to settings. I'll use the stylus and then from there go to data management, micro SD management. You'll just hit next three times but if you want to read through it, next, 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 next. Um, the Wi-Fi connection we're going to use is woot woot and you're going to have to name your device. Let's just call this 3DS XL. Now just a heads up, um, you can't use any spaces so just make sure um, it's one word and password. I like just to make it easy simply because no one else is probably going to use it. Okay, sure, why not? Connecting to network. Go to your network and open the device below. All right. So from there, you can just head on over to your PC and I'll actually head over to the screenshot here of my screenshot a screen grab of my PC and record from there. Let's go! So once you've set up the first part with your Nintendo 3DS XL all you have to do is open a folder, head over to networks. For some reason if this is not showing up it does um, take a little bit to reach your network just click refresh and it should show up. And in case it does ask for a password, don't forget to use the password that you used. Um, but for the most part, it shouldn't do that. Okay, from there, you'll have access to your micro SD. Now, all of your pictures will be pretty much in the first folder, whether that's the pictures you've taken with your camera or screenshots. And that's pretty much what I'll be using this for. And the other ones are save files and things of that nature. From here, you can pretty much highlight <clears throat> Which, one, which ones you would like to save. It's a picture of the dog. And the easiest way to actually see these is make sure you click right click on the folder, hit view, and extra large icon. So you can go ahead and view these documents. And from there, you can either create a new folder to your desktop or just drag it over anywhere. And from there, share it to your social media and whatnot. All right, so that's our quick tutorial on how to transfer your information from your new Nintendo 3DS to your PC. Um, if you have any questions, don't forget to leave us a comment. And if you guys have any questions about using the new Nintendo 3DS XL, leave us a comment. Who knows? It might be the topic of our next tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.